we have been had this whiskey donated by a firm called Gordon and McPhail up in Elgin. They're, they are whiskey bottlers, and they have over 5,000 casks of malt whiskey in their um, bonded warehouse up in Elgin. We have four separate tastes of malt whiskey. There are about 40 here, and what I'll do is I'll hand these out, and, and what we'll do is we'll just have a little taste. One thing I would say to you is that please, in all forms of alcohol, is to drink responsibly. Please don't drive if you're going to be drinking malt whiskey. Um, and I'll pass these out, and if you'd like to have a little taste, I'll just like to take. Excuse me. Sir, you want to try one? Anybody else? There we go. Yeah, sure, sure. Anybody else there? Oh, sorry. Yeah, sure. Now, ladies and gentlemen, as you probably know, you are in the heart of Speyside, and 20 miles from here are 42 distilleries which sit either side of the River Spey. Throughout Scotland, there are 95 malt whiskey producing distilleries, and at this moment, I think there's over 2,000 different types of malt whiskey. What we will do is we'll have a little taste of four separate malts, and these are ones that you might not come across so frequently. Um, for those of you who have never drunk malt whiskey before, the most important thing about it, first of all, is don't drink it. Now the reason for this is that first of all, when we look at malt, it's very important, and you've got a little glass here, you roll it around your glass, and you'll see what we call little icicles running down the side. That's the first sign of a very, very good malt. Now, this malt comes from the island of Arran. Now, this is the newest malt whiskey distillery, opened in 1995. It was one of the directors of um, Shebus, who then built a new distillery and started distilling malt. So this, in fact, is a nine-year-old single malt whiskey. Now, when you're drinking malt whiskey, it's very important that you don't just throw it back because it's very important. You can only taste four flavors, but your nose can detect 157 flavors. So it's very important that you nose it before you drink it. Now, take a little sniff, and with this, you'll get a little bit of sweetness, maybe a little bit of lavender, and you're now warning your brain what to expect. Now, take a little sip and roll it over your tongue. and it sort of tickles the senses there. Now, this is the secret of the malt whiskey. Nose it for the second time. Now it smells completely different. And this is the secret of malt whiskey. It's a complex layer of flavors. You will smell something completely different from what I will smell, and that's why we all have our different malt whiskies. I have a particular malt which I like, and I like it so much I will not share it with anybody. These ones, this is an Aaron, this is a, a nine-year-old malt whiskey, and when you have a second taste, I find it tastes a little bit sweeter. Very pleasant.